All right, today I'm going to be doing a oil change on my uh, lawnmower. It's a, uh, a lawn boy with a, a Kohler engine. For this, you don't need any tools. All you need to do is uh, turn the lawnmower on its side to drain the oil into an oil pan. Uh, what I've got for uh, equipment is the SAE 30 motor oil, some shop rags, uh, an oil catch pan, and some gloves since I'm dealing with oil products. The recommended service schedule for this is uh, an oil change after the first five hours of use when it's brand new and then every 50 hours of use thereafter. Um, prior to uh, doing the oil change it's best to have the engine running for a short period of time to warm the oil up as it flows out better and uh, will bring out more contaminants as well. So the first thing we're going to do is remove the oil filler cap before uh, turning the lawnmower on its side. Now that that's removed, we'll, uh, we'll turn it over. It is recommended by the manufacturer that you, you turn it uh, towards the, the oil side uh, so that it pours out directly into the drip pan uh, as opposed to turning it over in the other direction which would uh, put it over the, the gas filler cap. On the dipstick, you'll notice there's two holes, uh, one at the bottom and one just slightly higher, and those indicate your minimum and maximum oil levels, and we'll be checking those periodically on the dipstick as we fill the uh, lawnmower back up with oil. When you're adding oil, you might find a, f a funnel useful, but because my oil is already being used a bit, it's pretty easy to pour. And as mentioned, pour a small amount in, and then we'll check the level on the dipstick. After you check the dipstick level, um, you can add more if required. Um, if it's full, then just leave it as that. Um, for me, I have to add a small amount more. If you overfill it, it's recommended that you pour a small amount out until it's just back at the uh, filled line on your dipstick. Once I'm all finished with the oil change, uh, what I do is take the old oil and, and put it into a larger container. And then once the, the large container is full, I bring that to a reuse center in the city that takes them for free. Uh, that's all there is to doing the oil change on uh, this kind of lawnmower. Uh, thanks for checking out the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe.